Welcome to the walkthrough for Mallet Flux, Contemporary Mallets in Motion. In this video, we will show you our different single instruments and their articulations. Our numerous ensemble patterns. how to work with our mallet sequences in the flux engine, and how to balance your sound in the mixer. Finally, we show you how to use mallet flux in the best way to compose a film soundtrack. First, let's open up the Library tab. You'll find a single patch containing all five instruments and the Mallet Flux Ensemble NKI. Let's take a look at the Ensemble NKI first and see how the Flux engine works. Our Flux engine was designed to easily combine various mallet colors and rhythms. You can select from multiple articulations, including hard and soft mallets, long and short tones, plus bowed bars and reverse samples. Just load different mallet instruments in our five independent slots and play them all together. Here is a first quick impression how the five instruments can play together using our pre-designed sequences. What you've just listened to is one of our 270 scenes offering lots of different mallet ensemble sequences and textures for instant access. All mallet instruments were recorded with many different velocity layers and round robins to let them sound totally realistic. If you turn the mod wheel up and down while holding a chord, you can watch the step dynamics move along and hear how the mallet ensemble reacts like a brilliant live ensemble following your conducting and performing extremely naturalistic crescendi or decrescendi. Now let's have a look at the preset browser and see how our scenes are organized. Sequence contains all complex rhythmic phrases and sequences. Use these to build the rhythmic and pulsating tonal core of your compositions. With our basic scenes, you'll get sequences focusing on repetitive tonal rhythms all following the notes that you press. ARP contains all arpeggio-based sequences, offering a rich variety of multi-layered arpeggiating patterns. The Flux Engine is doing great work in spreading and unfolding your pressed notes in a musical and complex way. You can play chords or even just single notes and it will always sound rich and interesting. If you press Flux, you'll leave the natural mallet sounds aside and have direct access to our modified sounds and sequences. We used complex multi-effect chains to offer an even more cinematic and otherworldly approach. If you already know the feel and meter of your composition, you can reduce our selection of scenes to the ones that fit your musical concept. If you press single, the browser shows you numerous single articulation combis. When using the single NKI, we can write single notes within the product and write directly to MIDI. You'll find simple hits, combined reverse or bowed pad textures, and even futuristic pulsating drones. Let's go back to our main page. Besides assigning our instruments and articulations to your slots, you can quickly modify the octave occupancies of your slots individually. By clicking on this little icon, you can open the settings and modify our sounds. Playing with the envelopes of your selected sounds, you can already achieve some pretty cool effects. If you want, you can choose from several filter or modulation settings and modify your sound further. On the mixer page, 
You can fine-tune the ensemble's balance and adjust panning using familiar controls. Shape the sound with EQ and compression. Add replica delay to get beautiful echoes and shimmering. Select from multiple reverbs to create the perfect room or space for your sounds. Let's open the sequencer by clicking on one of the sequences. The Flux Engine works through five independent slots which can be used separately as either step sequencer or arpeggiator. This way, complex interlocking patterns are possible. Selecting the different instruments, you can see how individually the engine can handle the separate slots. Our engine offers numerous possibilities to modify a selected scene or even create a new one from scratch. You can explore new rhythmic and tonal possibilities by modifying step dynamics, sequence length, arpeggio settings, rate, repeats, octaves, and much more. As you can see, there are two sequence tabs for every slot. The upper sequence is triggered when the mod wheel is all the way up and plays at maximum velocity. When it's down, the sequencer plays the opposite at minimum velocity. A middle mod wheel position will blend both sequence settings, so you can always get a great flow with your sequence by using the mod wheel and creating beautiful crescendos and decrescendos. You can produce real-time changes in rhythmic structure. Just assign different accents or step dynamics to the two sequencer lines and watch how the rhythm is changing while moving the mod wheel. Now let's have a quick look at our single NKI. Click on the instrument name to change the instrument. You can select different articulations by key switch or by clicking on the articulation name. You can change the envelope and mic position easily and shape your basic sound. On the effects page, you can add Contact's new replica delay and you can select from our built-in reverbs. Let's have a quick look at the individual sounds. Now, let's look how all these features can work together in a film soundtrack. We'll start with a small intro in D minor using our single instrument Celesta. We double it with glockenspiel and add a bowed pad to make the sound a little more interesting. Here is a nice basic groove building a rhythmic bass with 16th feel. For now, I'm just playing one single note which is already creating a rich rhythmic flow. For the bass line, we take a drone and turn it one octave lower. Furthermore, we add a higher scene giving some wide shimmer to the passage. Now we add a flux scene, sounding a little futuristic as we shape the envelope with late attacks on each note. Let's now use one of our flux beat scenes to generate a purely non-tonal percussive part. Now we're getting to the theme which contains a chord progression and a melody. As we want to show the full chord progression with mallets, let's add a nice cinematic scene playing the chords. And another one with a very wide stereo panning to open up the arrangement a little further, which can make the arrangement a bit more exciting.
That's it for now. We hope you enjoyed the video and have fun using Mallet Flux for your own compositions.